All right then, what is up boys and girls? Welcome back to another video. As always, thank you very much for joining me, Crypto Maximalist, for another video today. Please do make sure to like and subscribe and also leave a comment down below. It really, really helps out the channel. And with that being said, we are just taking a quick look here at Veracity on the daily time frame. We can see we've been grinding under this resistance of this Fibonacci 038 for quite some time now, probably a week or so. You can see we're pretty much just following perfectly what Bitcoin's doing, but with a bit more volatility. Bitcoin obviously has been grinding to the upside over the past, what is it, three weeks or so after breaking out of its range. You can see obviously Veracity with a tokenomics update did break out of this long standing resistance that we formed. You can see the bull market high of the previous bull market. This swing high that we made after the big pump at the, at the start of the year. We broke out the bear market resistance here. As you can see, formed a new resistance. Continued to test this over and over again, forming this very nice descending wedge. We've got the breakout back test of the Fibonacci level, ran up to the next Fibonacci level, which is the 038, which is at around, what is this, a ninth of a cent. Currently sitting at th around three quarters of a cent right now for Veracity. And just basically looking like it's consolidating, creating a bit of bullish market structure, back testing, and now having a little bit of a rally today. Looking like it wants to break this level here. We do need to clear this whole area, really, don't we? This one cent psychological level of big, big, obviously a big resistance and at that extension around 1.1 cents where we did see the swing high put in here if we can see ourselves clearing this area heading up to the next Fibonacci level coming back and retesting I do think that two cent level at the 618 which has been my technical target for a while it's probably going to be fairly apparent you can see obviously the size of the move here the big long consolidation and then you can see the breakout target is perfectly at that 618 still waiting for this to be the case obviously can take some time for these things to play out, but you can see we are slowly making our way now towards that technical target. My long-term target of around 50 cents to $1 still holds as well. I do think overall this channel is looking very, very nice indeed, as you can see. I do think overall this is probably going to do pretty damn good as we go into the future. I'm really, really excited to see what Veracity does in the next bull market. Lots of people are packing up their bags right now at these low prices. Congratulations if you bought an absolute ton at that fifth of a cent level you would currently be at around a 4x since the start of the year. 400% gain in a year is a pretty damn good gain. Maybe not in crypto, but certainly pretty much anywhere else. But as we can see, I do think that Veracity is probably going to continue with its bullish momentum going into the bull market next year, which I think is probably going to happen. Considering we have got the Bitcoin halving in less than six months, we've seen the market starting to move. Very exciting times indeed. And overall, I think Veracity is doing fine. It's doing what it needs to do. You can see here, this channel that we formed, backtest, backtest, extension, extension. We've got backtest and backtest. And now what we're looking for is in 2024 and 2025 to get that extension, extension at the top of the big channel. And that would hopefully take us up to around that $1 level, maybe even beyond, depending on how ridiculous things might get. Obviously, there are no guarantees in life with anything, especially in cryptocurrency, extremely risky and hard to predict what's going to happen. But I think overall, Veracity is just looking really, really good in the macro. And in terms of the current area of the chart, really, it's just doing everything that it needs to do, isn't it? We've got the breakout, the back test, bullish market structure, coiling up here into kind of underneath this resistance of the 038 after a back test of this previous level as well. I think with a bit more bullish momentum in the markets, we could see Veracity break into the upside pretty soon. So that would be my analysis for today, guys. Thank you very much, as always, for watching. Please do like and subscribe and leave a comment, as I said before. And please do also go down below and join the free Discord. I'm going to start this up again now with the new bull market coming really successful in the last bull market. So I want to keep rebuild the community that has been lost due to the fact that everyone left, which is fair enough during the bear market. But right now, go down below, click on the, fr on the link, join the free Discord. Totally free, as I said. Or if you want to join the private part of the Discord, you can sign up as a YouTube member. Just get a bit more personal access to me in there. And also, I will be posting some inside kind of information about stuff I'm looking at etc so if that's interesting to you sign up as a YouTube member if not then join the free discord below and I'll see you in the next video cheers